Welcome to Good Mythical More. Who has the innate ability to be able to look at an item and tell how much it should be microwaved for? <laughs> Me or you, because it's one of us. Well, it has something to do with numbers, so I will, I'm gonna be upset if you beat me. I have so. only cooked things by microwaving them. You have a lot of microwave experience, that's true. It might balance out. Don't freak out, but a magician just stole your nose. Oh so, my goodness. And don't goodness. freak out. He's he's standing right behind you with your nose, and he's naked. <laughs> don't freak out because he's naked, and no one's thinking about the fact that you don't have a nose because they're like, how did this trick turn into this guy being naked? Yeah, that's all they're thinking about. Now later on, you're gonna want to freak out because not having a nose might be a problem. But right now, don't freak out. Don't freak out because he's he's. Even though he's naked, he is still a magician, and at the end of the trick, he will give you back your nose. I mean, that's what every magician with a license does. Right, uh, but he might be an unlicensed naked magician. You yeah, don't know. freak out. He is not licensed. Okay, okay. okay. bites. Okay, let's start there. I mean, do, I All se- nine. I seem to remember that you, what are you doing, Stofers? Trying to, trying to, Trying to give me a little love lick. Y'all know what a love lick is? I don't know no, if, that, thank you. if that made it out of my family, but like that's when you inflict pain on someone to show that you love them. Like punch them or pinch them or pinch them, as my family that used the term love lick would say. Now, just so we're all, we all know, they have blanked out the cooking instructions. So looking at the back, only reason I'm looking at the back is to see that it says, Place all nine frozen bagel bites in the microwave oven. So this is to cook all nine of these little bagel bites. And I, what I was trying to say was, I seem to remember that you claim to be, have the innate power, and it's, I don't know what it's venue, a totally different power of, of being able to know ex- when it's about to end. When it when it's about to ding. I can walk ding. into the kitchen when it's about to ding and open it right before it dings. Because that's it, a that's a power that that's an actual sort of ESP. That's a supernatural metaphysical thing. This is more just the power of estimation. So, which, you guys don't have a lot of bagel bite experience, do you? No, no. Yeah. It, this is uh, we do, almost we, as foreign to me as a bagel itself. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have these in the McLaughlin household. So you have these like in your freezer? No, not present day. But th- this was one of my go-to pre-soccer uh, practice. <laughs> really? Snacks? Gosh, that yeah. seems like a, the worst choice you can make. Well, my other choice, I feel like, is much worse, which is the. Um, a California roll from the grocery store. And we're talking, what was this, like late 90s, early 2000s grocery store sushi? Grocery store sushi before. Well, so and how many go in this? You don't put that in the microwave, though. No. How many go in this? Nine, you said? Nine. So nine of these. Uh, We do a three, two, one, and we're going to say how long we think. And you can't, you lose if you go over. So price is right style. So you got to be careful. Three, two, one. Two minutes. Three minutes. Two minutes, 20 seconds. Oh, <laughs> dang it. Okay. Yeah. Taking the early lead. Yeah, bro. But you got a toaster oven, the bagel bites. Like, microwaving the bagel oh, bites. Yeah, horrible idea. Horrible it's idea just, to microwave. Yeah, you know why I mean, is that a thing? You know what I do there. You know a sogginess? Who wants a wet, artificial tasting pizza experience? I mean, some people. We discovered that some things Chase are just as good in the microwave as the oven. We, we did all types of tests. I can remember none of the results. That's why we should we should write them all down and put them in a place. Yeah. Right. Okay. So Chef Boyardee beef ravioli and pasta sauce. Now I think this might be just fine in the microwave. If you if you had to eat this as a as a dish at home, would you be the guy now? Are you gonna put this in my in the microwave or are you gonna put this on the stovetop? Because Wait, uh, you can't put that in the microwave. Well, no, you pour it out and put it in a bowl and put it in the microwave. Okay, I just wanted to make it very clear for everyone. <laughs> but I'm saying that like I don't there's a lot of people who swear that they have to take soupy things and put them in the stovetop. We should do it. I don't know if this is a good enough for an episode of GMM, but I just believe that there's gen- there's generally no difference between soups that's been microwaved and soups that's been heated up on a stove. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Are you saying that yeah. we should do a soup dedicated episode of GMM? Because I just don't think we can. I mean, we've never done that before. And much less an three days. Matt Carney? A tournament of soups. 
Is this a sore subject for you guys? It didn't perform no. well? No. It performed great. Everyone loves soup. Right. Oh, it did perform great? Yeah, I mean, it did fine enough. Yeah, I mean, it, it successfully posted. Was I there for that? <laughs> was I there for that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah, I, I agree. I think you, gotta uh, put, it you put it in the microwave. Now, th this is the time. Wait. What if it says there's a time, then there's what? a stir, then there's more time? Do we add up the time? I'm sorry. Can you go back to what you agree with? You agree that you need to put it in the microwave just versus as putting good in the it microwave. just as good in the microwave. Yeah, yeah. You're, you're not doing anything when you put it into a pot. It's not adding flavor because it's just getting hot. It's just it's all in your head. Right. And if you're one of those folks who thinks but, that microwaving something makes it toxic, mm -hmm. like there was this whole thing that went around that said that microwave some water and then water your plants with it and they will die. That is not true, and I've had multiple people repeat it to me. It's not true. Uh, it is true. You don't pour boiling water on no, your plants. No, no. If you microwave water and then let it cool back down to I've cooked my plants. They're saying that yeah. letting it cool down. I know. So yeah. that's not true. My, the microwaves don't make anything radioactive. The science doesn't allow for that. It's fine. But You're gonna be okay. I think it's more about the time in which the heat is applied, if I could make the argument. Once I don't know it. if I completely you believe, You think you know the difference? You're that's why we so need to do it. We need to do it as a test. Um, okay. Well, you I, can also- I'll agree to a more. You can also do the thing that no one does, which is change the cook level on the microwave so that it takes longer. Even when it says oh, to I, do that, it's really hard to do I it. I do it all the time. <laughs> you do? You just said no one does it. I do yeah. it more often than not. I don't do it. Well, if it says to do it, I follow the directions exactly. Let's give it's a number. It's important. Three, two, one. Two minutes. Two thirty. One minute thirty. Oh yeah, Which soup means going soup, too hot. Soup gets hot. I get quick. the point. I'm going too high. Soup gets who am I, hot. Who am I kidding? I don't microwave stuff. I eat cold things. I don't even microwave things. Stouffer's, classic grandma's chicken and vegetable rice bake. Oh, look, look at who it is. It's Chase, this thing he's, is, got, he's got that big apple. This thing is huge, yes. You thought I'd forgotten. Uh, actually, I did forget. David reminded me. <laughs> That's a big apple. <laughs> this is a big apple. I mean, I, I think you might get more leverage with that. Ladies and gentlemen, Chase Still. is about to rip the biggest apple in the history of Good Mythical Morning apart with his bare this hands. This might be the biggest apple I've ever seen in person. <laughs> and he's going to unabashedly apple. make the sound that he makes when he rips an apple open with is his he bare gonna, hands. Is he going to make the sound that he makes, or is he going to make the sound that you think that he makes in your memory? <laughs> That's because the sound that he makes in your memory is a little even funnier than the sound he actually makes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, go with that. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to tap into your memory. Okay. <laughs> Man, hey, you, wow. you made short work of that thing. That Look was that. awesome, Jay. That was a pretty good sound. Too. You did, and you had a great Dang. lead in. There was a little. <laughs> it was a little squeak that, le that led into it. That was quick, a dude. You're, big apple. You really, what's the secret? Because you've discovered it. It's gotten easier for you. The secret is uh, getting apples via Instacart once a week and practicing. Practicing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, right, yeah. right, right, right. Does it, is the bigger apple actually easier? It actually was easier because I could dig more yeah. of my fingers in. Yeah. The bigger really... the apple, the quicker the chase breaks. So when you take this show on the road, <laughs> or at least like take it down to the Santa Monica Pier, mm -hmm. you can be like, and now, for the biggest apple you've ever seen, and everybody's gonna be like, oh, there's no way you can break that big Very ass impressive. apple. impressive. And That's then you just thought. do it. Mm -hmm. eh. I want 10%. <laughs> this is a huge Eight thing. This is something that should probably go in the oven. Okay, I'm gonna read a little bit about the instructions here to see if it is uh, on high. Uh, okay, so it's cooking on high. Now I will say it oh, says- What are you reading? Right there. I will say it says, uncovered cook an additional two minutes. So we're saying the first number. The first time you cook it while it's covered before you add the two minutes. So take that into account that this is gonna- It also says leave film on tray and do not vent. Well, that's risky. How heavy is this thing? It's, that is thick on high, and then you take it out. There's So Stevie, we're just guessing the first number, uh -huh. not the additional two minutes. Three, two, one. Six Nine. minutes. Nine. Oh, man, you guys are both low. 14. Yeah, 16. Well, that was my first guess. I didn't even get a second guess. Okay. 
I'll give you the point. Uh, 14 minutes on high. Now the stuff. The Stouffer's lasagna, I was, I love that stuff, man. Something about it, it's just like, nice. I, bet I wanna take this I home bet, and I eat bet it. that would be good too. Real cheddar cheese, it's just another. chicken and vegetable rice bake. You want us not to look? Or are you getting nervous? Rhett, Rhett's reading stuff, we shouldn't read it. We won't read anything. Um, chicken wings in the microwave? Mac and cheese. It's pretty dang good. I bet it is. Yep. Not in the microwave. In, it's the one I'm talking about the lasagna, and you're talking about the mac and cheese that's in the aluminum foil yeah, tin. Yeah, yeah. I bet you this is really good. I bet it's really good. Okay. Does this have bones in it? Yeah. Okay. So bone in. My family has not this brand, but does this now in the microwave. Nine times out of 10, we do it in the oven because the oven is gonna give you a much better experience. But we have tried it in the microwave just to see what happens. Now, oh, I do not okay. remember how long it was in You did there. your own little GMM at home. But you put them in there frozen. I think. See, you're, you, you... Place, eight, place eight wings in a circle. Eight wings in a circle, and it does say frozen. Frozen wings with the bone in them in a circle. Uh, before we give our answer, I want to remind you we're super proud of the Rhett and Link single Lionel vinyl. We got back there, the, the, the vinyl opens up and shows a glorious recreation of the um, most amazing pose in music history uh, performed by us. Also, the songs on it are performed by us. Yep. So it's, um, it's, it's quite an endeavor. You want to own it. We want you to own it. You got to join the third degree monthly of the Mythical Society by April 30th or third degree quarter of their annual plan by June 30th to get the Rhett and Link Sing Lionel record. Mythicalsociety.com. Uh, now, I'm going to have to say something. Uh, I had a guess in mind, and then when I looked at that, the, the, the Sharpie that they had covered up had come off because of the water, and I saw the answer. So I'm going to have to sit this round out. All right, so it's just if I go over or not. All right. Well, uh, do you need a three, two, one? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> three, two, one. One dollar. Okay, he said dollar, that doesn't count. You're not gonna guess? One minute. You think one minute for eight wings and a thing? Yep. He's trying not to go over because I've disqualified myself. Yeah. My, I mean, I'll tell you my real answer was 13 minutes. But my, I was going to say 10 minutes, my, and my then I saw the real answer. answer, which both of us are over. Yeah, it's nine minutes. Nine minutes. And were they any good? Did you say that? Um, they were edible, but they were nowhere We've near, already done this nowhere near oh, the oven. Nope. Oh, look, it is the lasagna with meat sauce. Two times the meat? With meat and sauce, not just meat sauce. Okay, so this one is you gotta put it in a microwave safe container. And if you turn it over this way, look at that. Man, you, you still can read it. You can, you can display you it two different it. ways. You still read it. it it's, it's shelf and, and um, what's it? Shelf. Stable. No, when it doesn't care. Uh, agnostic. Shelf agnostic. And this shelf agnostic. And, and this shelf one. Shelf agnostic. Go either way. What was go this? Go on its side, go on its top. This was 14 minutes? 16. 18. 18 minutes. Or 16 and then a two. Si oh, 16 and then the extra two. Mm. Lasagna, got those layers. It's a little bit lighter. I'm ready to vote. This is intricate, I'll say. The process? Yeah. All right, so we're just going for Total the time? Just go for total time. Total time. You said it was intricate, okay. Three, two, one. 18, 18 minutes. 18. In 17 minutes, 59 seconds. 18, I'm sticking I'm sticking with 18. That's not, 20, I, I just, that was not a, yeah. Nine. Was, what? 29. Oh, 29? Microwave on high, nine minutes, uncover, and then cook again for 20 minutes at 50% power. Yeah, oh yeah, get that 50% power, it gets it nice. Se but you do that second, that's interesting. Yeah. You, you really wanna get let it know it's being cooked and then you wanna just cook it. Huh. Nice I, and easy. Wouldn't you have guessed that you go with the half power first, though? 
Uh, usually, I think yeah. it's because it wants you to try and crispify. You know, like when you sear something, or you put but it you in there, and then you, then you turn it down. You? No. Really? For like really? A, for, I guess for like a slow cooked meat, it's then got, you it's slow cook, and then the you meat. sear it. Two times the meat of what? Required by the lasagna with meat sauce standard. No, with standard. a steak, you sear it. You sear both sides. You can, yeah, you sear and then you, then you go the inside. Hold on, I'm I'm intrigued by this. Yeah, for a for a slow cooked meat, right? I guess that's what I'm thinking. Two times right? the meat required by the lasagna with meat sauce standard. There is a lasagna with meat sauce standard. I'm, I'm how do you get to be on that board? I'm glad to hear it. Well, you know how as you get older. You start like, you're on boards and stuff. It's yeah, like something yeah. that happens. I want to be on the board of the lasagna with I mean, meat it says sauce it right there. board. How do I get to be on the lasagna board? I'd be great at that. Agricultural Marketing Service is a is a designation of the USDA or a, yes, click, click, on, the, click on the Reddit. The Reddit, there's a lasagna with meat sauce standard. And, and, and this image is what's posted at the top of that Reddit thread. Um, assuming it's the U.S. standard, here you go, page 91. Lasagna sauce is an expected ingredient of lasagna products and its declaration in the product name is optional. Ch cheese lasagna with meat, 12% meat. Lasagna with meat and sauce, 12% 12 12 meat. meat. Lasagna with meat sauce, meat sauce, 6% meat in total product. So meat and sauce, you get double the meat of meat sauce by percentage. Lasagna with poultry, 8% poultry. The way poultry. you explain that didn't compute in my brain. So. If it's meat sauce, it has to be only 6%. If it's with 6%, meat, it has to be 12%. Yeah, 6% of it is meat, but 12% of it is meat with meat and sauce. Okay. Twice, twice the percentage. You know this twice the meat situation the meat. got heated, no pun intended, in order for it to get to this point. Like there was, there were multiple heated arguments oh, about yeah, this yeah. situation. But the th all of a sudden, this is very impressive because what I'm being told is that this has 24% meat. This is a quarter meat. <laughs> I, I, think, I think I would actually have two big stars. One would say two times the meat, and then the second one would be, meat by the way, standard. that's almost one quarter meat. Go nope, up to 25% nope, 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 meat. Nope, 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 you're wrong. Two times the meat required by the lasagna with meat sauce standard. Oh, it's 12%. Okay, so forget So it's about meat it. sauce. So meat and, that's why they call it meat and sauce. The trickery. It's the 12 per, trickery. Oh, no, 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 look. Lasagna with meat and sauce is, okay. So, but this, you're saying that this is from Stouffer's? Because if it's two no. times the standard, the standard for lasagna with meat and sauce is 12% meat. It, it, listen to me. Here's what I'm trying to tell you, Rhett. This is not twice the meat and sauce standard. They're, they're, by virtue of calling it meat and sauce, it's twice the meat sauce standard. Wow, this is absolute, this is so deceptive, Stouffer's. Two by times putting the an meat. and, by putting an and, they can make it seem like they have twice the meat, but they just have this, if they took the and out, it, they couldn't put two times the meat on there. It would just be the same amount of meat. Yeah, it would be the right amount of meat and sauce meat but it's twice the amount of meat in meat sauce because it's not meat sauce, it's, it's meat, meat and, sauce. and sauce. We've cracked the case. I'm mad at you, Stouffer's, but I still wanna take this home and eat it. I know, but I want this one. And I already had it, and position, possession Do you is, think your family's gonna eat that? I, I was saying before I knew it was here how much I loved it. Okay, all right. All right. And you have that one. Okay. And Stevie got the bagel bites because she's think, going to soccer practice. I think you're gonna take that home and your, and your wife. I mean, I know that why my wife and my children are gonna look at me like, Dad, you're gonna eat this by yourself while watching the news. <laughs> it's like the whole, the <laughs> the whole, whole thing. You're gonna, the watch, news? you're gonna watch the thing that no one else wants to watch with you okay. and eat the thing that no one wants to eat with you. Uh, well, I mean, here, you know what? Will you call me when you make this? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, seriously, you call me. Only if you eat the, because I'm not joking. I'll watch the news with you. I'm going to eat the whole thing in one sitting. I only will watch the news with you if you eat the whole meat and the so, whole thing. So let me get this straight. You wanted it, but now that I'm coming over, you want me to eat all of it. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we'll have, we'll go halvesies. 
But you got to finish because if you're going to leave something on your plate, it's going to be it's going to upset me. It, <laughs> I've been through this exercise as a child, and it's determined to be psychologically damaging to to require clean your plate. Who's the damaged one between the two of us? <laughs> All right, all right, next Me. one. Me, that's what I just said. This is the, the I didn't know Stouffer's was going to be, this? no, 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 I don't, the, the, go to the one that is not this one. The one that's the finale one is 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 where I want to go. Uh, the, the turkey? Because, you yeah. know what? We're not getting to this one. If this yeah. is what you clicked for, it ain't happening. Yeah. Uh, DiGiorno's got a stuffed crust pizza. A little single serve? I can watch the news and eat that, too. Oh, my God. You're going to microwave. Yeah, 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 that, that big this? daddy. Tender and juicy turkey breast. I'm not going to look at it because it seems like this is going to have been like marked up in a way that I'm going to be able to see it. Uh, how many pounds are we talking about? Uh, it's a nine no, pound turkey. Yeah. Eleven, I would say. Nine, nine. See, I'm, I go over it everything. I'm so extra today. Well, nine first of all, turkey. you're gonna. I, I know for a fact that you're going to have to do this. Do you have to thaw it first? Yeah. Is it? Do you thaw it first? No. You cook it from frozen. Okay. Put it for, okay. This is total cook time. So you're going to basically you probably start at 30% power for a certain amount of time because that's a defrost. That's the defrost section. <sighs> I'm doing me. total time. It's not that this is boring, but. And then I'm going to go up to maybe 50 to 60% power for another amount of time. And I'm never going to go to high on this one. So you're including the defrosting in the cooking. Oh, now Chase is saying. This is just defrosting it in the microwave time. Because you Not can't cook the whole thing in the microwave. You shouldn't you, do that. No one would eat that. I think you can, but I guess we're just looking for the defrost time. Oh, just the defrost so time. So defro defrost is about 30% power. Uh, okay. Uh, hold on. Okay. Ready to guess? Yeah. Three, two, one. 42. 22 minutes. 42 minutes. I hope he went over. I was determined not to go over. 54 oh, minutes. Dang it. 54 You dirty minutes. dog. Six right. minutes per pound. That's crazy. Hey, that talk about putting your microwave to work. That'll do it. Sometimes I put stuff in my microwave, and then we realize that it doesn't work. My microwave only, it's a crapshoot. It only works like every third time. That's, you should look into it. But it seems like it's working. Does your microwave double as an oven? No. We got the same, it's the same one that we have in here that can be used as an oven. And uh, a couple of times our actual oven has broken, like the igniter or whatever got was broken and we've cooked in that thing. And so in that microwave, you could defrost this turkey and then switch it to oven mode and you, no one would ever know that you did it all in a microwave. You wanna impress your friends. I, I really don't. To get the Rhett and Link Sing Lionel vinyl release, join Third Degree Monthly by April 30th or Third Degree Quarterly or Annual by June 30th. Visit mythicalsociety.com for details.